The monkey fist is the most difficult of all Chinese martial arts. It calls for coordination of every part of the body, limbs, eyes, brain, and heart. With the coming of the Qing dynasty, the art was forgotten. The monkey fist featured in this motion picture is based on research of the ancient chronicles of Chinese martial arts with certain modifications and refinements. Eagle claw style can hope to compete with the monkey fist. The eagle claw and the monkey fist are presented here to honor those heroes of bygone days who developed these remarkable techniques. Captain Pa, Captain Ye, seeking, seeking an audience. audience. Our, Our respects, respects, General. General. <clears throat> How dare you come back without a single rebel's head? But, General, we've put an agent into the rebels' organization. We know who the leader is, where he lives. We are watching the whole group, around the clock. All we need is your orders to move. You kill everyone, young and old, as they lessen to all the others. I just heard that a group of Kang Si was infiltrated by an agent, a Qing man. Everyone was killed. We must be most careful. You're from Kangxi. What did you hear there? <sighs> Only that there were spies, though. And the Qings moved in and killed the whole group. <sighs> Master, where's your eldest son now? I should think he must be quite a man, eh? <laughs> He's useless. <laughs> If you don't pay your debts, I'll beat you to death. If I'm dead, 
then you'll get nothing. But if I'm alive, then maybe I'll win yet. Huh? You'll win? Huh. What do you bet? <laughs> <laughs> My life, because that's all I got left. All right? Young fool, who are you? Who's your father? Hey, just forget my father. My name doesn't matter. You must have a name. <laughs> if you need a name, <laughs> just call me Iron. Beat him up! Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Damn you. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. All right, all right. I don't mind gambling with him. You don't want him dead. <laughs> hey, hey, that, come on, come on, come on. Hey, all right, all right. All right, that's all right. That's all right. Well, we'll carry on with our plans now as arranged. <laughs> You are all under arrest. General's orders. Let's go fight them, huh? Right, job here. I'll tell the general. He'll reward you. <laughs> Thank you for your kindness, Captain. Bring him in. Don't get him. Guy like heroes. Hmm. How very brave. No one. Right. This one's quite pretty. What do you think? Mm. I'll have her. Mm. Huh? Take her out. Get right. <coughs> there is another son, but he's out now. Uh, where is he? <laughs> I've no elder son. You tell me, I'll spare you. them all up. Then go out. Find that son.
Did my father send a matchmaker around? Huh? You've got to be serious. <laughs> Your family's in trouble. My dad's a hero. He's tough. No trouble bothers him. He'll fix it no matter what. This morning, the troops surrounded your house. They rested on your family. They say that they'll all be killed. Keep him locked up at home. I, I was careless. He got out. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. More careless. You tell me you've good news, but you missed the traitor's son, though. My lord, everybody says that son is just a playboy. He does nothing at all. 
except gambling. I think he'll be no threat. You fool! Never take a chance. In this sort of case, you ought to know that. Sir, don't worry. We'll have everybody looking for him. <laughs> My Lord General, we caught a pretty young girl. She was a maid. We brought her here, and it did occur to us that you might like her. Hold it. Tomorrow noon, you execute the whole family. <laughs> tells us where the eldest son is, will be spared. monkey thief has no fixed time. So to catch him, we'll have to wait all night. Huh? And so what? And why say monkey? It's a man. It's no monkey. I mean, it's too smart. It's a man. I'm sure of it. Huh? Man? Who would have the nerve to steal a Shaolin temple? or a monkey.
out in the woods. Accepted. Well, that's fine. We'll be brothers, fellow students. has deep hatred and he wants to learn and he can take hardship I think he'll do well and what is your name where are you from and what is it you hate until I can prove myself here I want to keep my name a secret and that's why I didn't dare to come here. Forgive me. It's not disrespect. Of course, of course. When you join us, you'll have to study hard and learn the word of Buddha. Then this bitter hatred that's within you may disappear. Brother. The boy has a good stance. I think that he'll do well. Men like him usually learn quickly. In a few months, I reckon he'll be one of the best pupils here. Buddha had mercy on you. It was his hand that led you to us. So then, don't waste this chance you have. joined us now. You will need a name. Teacher, he sells food like a monkey and climbs like a monkey as well. Call him Iron Monkey. Brother, in a temple, how can a man be given the name of a mere animal? Before the sight of Buddha, both man and animal, are just the same. Both are equal. Your name, Iron Monkey. Is for seniors. Oh. Mm. Hey, 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 further back. Go on. 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 Go
You learn to use that style. This is your first day here, and you're already doing quite well. Uh, well, when I sneaked in here, I used to watch. So I picked up a bit. That's all. Hmm. Well, show us what you've learned. month. To do so well, so quickly, is great. Hmm. Brother, don't say that. The others here won't like it. <laughs> don't worry. Master checks us once a month to see what we've learned. You'll know by tomorrow what place he thinks you should have here. I don't care whether it's front or back. All I want to do here is to learn. You are right. But still, you do what you're told. Listen, why do you refuse to tell us what your real name is and about your background? Brother, I really owe you, and I should tell you. But still, ah, it's all right. Come, let's practice some. Brother, I daren't. Why? Scared you'll be hurt?
I'd like to have your permission to shave my head. But why can't I? Aren't I good enough yet? Oh, no. It isn't that. You're very good. You've done so well. All of us here agree on that. But you're still tied to the outside world yet. And you can't let it go. Deep in your eyes, I can still see hatred and bloodshed. So you ask yourself, be honest, are you ready yet to forsake the outside world, devote yourself to Buddha's work? Only when all of your passions have left you, are you ready to join us here? Teacher, I, I'm confused. But you do know what Buddha teaches, though. You will reap what you sow. Good seed brings forth good, bad seed brings forth bad. And in your life, someone has planted much evil. You'll repay him in kind. Thank you, teacher. Behold it. Teacher thinks you're much better than I am. I don't like that. If you're so good, then prove it to us. It's all right. Students should test each other. So you go ahead. Or else, <clears throat> they'll be real annoyed. you fight. You've been here a month. To do so well, so quickly, is great. Now look. Shaolin men aren't cowards. None of them because he thinks he's better than we are. Well, <clears throat> you're wrong. The master says I'm full of hatred, and he's right. Can't control it. It scares me. Hey, just listen to him. So he thinks if he fights us, he's afraid that he'll kill us all. Huh? Is that right? Huh? Is that right? <laughs> techniques. You have all the fundamentals. So now you must choose the technique you wish to specialize in. Concentrate on those then, and nothing else. While there's no limit on how many you choose, that is left up to you. But still, you should remember, don't choose too many. 
The fewer, the better. Teacher, I am quite confident. I can learn them all. Every style. <laughs> <laughs> well, then you'll stay in the temple here all your life. <laughs> in Shaolin, there's one technique that in the past only one man has ever mastered. It takes much time, and anyone who wants to learn that technique may not choose any other technique. This technique? What is it? Well, it's known as Shaolin Monkey Fist. Huh? Monkey? In that case, the monkey should learn it. <laughs> Teacher, I'll learn it. Good. The one who mastered it and who will teach it you is the bitter monk. And he lives in the east wing of the temple. You go and see him now. Sir. You fool. Shaolin has lots of styles. Why ignore them and choose just one? Yeah. You've wasted all your time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ling Lei, you're the fool. He's going to be well above you. I promise you that. told me to come here, to learn the monkey fist style. So you were ordered to come here, not of your own free will. Leave me. Teacher, it was my choice. Is that the truth? I know the monkey fist is difficult, and that it will restrict me as well. But I want to learn. Good. The technique is most complex. But if you learn it well, you'll beat the rest. It's superior to all other techniques, but you may not succeed. I shall do my best. <coughs> I'm all ready. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you, teacher. Temple doesn't accept gifts from outside. So please, will you all leave now? We've not come here with gifts. We have a message from our Lord General. The Qing's now ruled here, and all people must obey them. But in this temple, we serve only God, the great Lord Buddha himself. No one else. Please leave. The Qing's rule everywhere. And the general has sent me with a special message for the students here. All the temple students are here now. Please go ahead and speak. The general says that he needs some more guards, thinks you may be suitable in view of your training. This could be a very good chance for you men. Good chance? Hmm. Shaolin martial arts are not too bad. The general takes the view that it would be a pity to waste this. And in this case, if you're interested, he'll offer you a job. Hmm. 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 Well, it's up to you. You want the job? Well, then you report to me within one month. <laughs> Brother, get them. <laughs> <laughs> this Buddha's in the wrong place. Move it back. Sir! All right, come on. Go. Come on. Move it. All right, now. Get right. Come on. Easy, easy, easy. Hey, you! Hey! It's okay. Just leave him. Sinful, sinful. That Buddha has been there for many years. So we better move it back. Buddha bless you. Buddha bless you. None of our students will work for the Chings. We are watching the whole group. Blessings, blessings. Buddha have mercy on us all. Hey, hey monkey, there. monkey, monkey. What have you been doing these last few years you've been away? Been playing with the monkey? <laughs> <laughs> insult me, but don't insult my teacher. <sighs> I hear that you've made good progress. I'm real glad. Congratulations. <laughs> Is that true or false? Hey, where are you going? We haven't talked for ages. I must go and see the master. Hey, why are you seeing him? Possibly. You're thinking of working for the Chings, huh?
Blessings, blessings. Buddha have mercy on us all. May he bless our lives. Master, what do you find when you look inside me now? You're still full of hatred. And this time I smell blood, so why are you here? Is it you want to leave the temple? Yes, sir. That's what I want to do. And what if I refuse you? I have to leave here, even if it means I have to use force. It's destiny. There is no choice. You leave then. If I succeed in what I propose, then I shall come back and stay in here all of my life. Well, sir, I've come here from Shaolin to join the Royal Guards. Who do you study with? I studied with the bitter monk, and I learned the Shaolin monkey fist technique. Tell me, why didn't the others come? Why only you then, huh? They're different, have different views. I wanted this, so I came. You any idea what this involves? What you'll do, huh? Simply that I'll obey the general's orders. <laughs> so you mean to say, you think you get your orders from the general? <laughs> You'll get your orders from me. Sir. <clears throat> general, Shaolin men all pretend to be neutral. In fact, they sympathize with those rebels and left alone. They'll make big trouble. From what you say, the pupils there wouldn't listen to you. And none of them would volunteer for our guards. How dare they insult me like that? And the throne too! Master, who are you in I greet you, General. Get up. Sir. My Lord General, a Shaolin man's come to join us. What's this man's name? Iron Monkey. Iron Monkey? Well, what do you think? He seems quite respectful. I think he'll be all right. But according to the report that you gave me, the Shaolin men refused to come and join us. So I suspect something. You just watch this man. And about those rebels now, what are your orders, General? The same as for all the rebels. Kill them all. Everyone. Sir! I suggest that we let the Iron Monkey do it. That way, we can test his Kung Fu. Also, we can test his loyalty. Sir! Hey, 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 what are we gonna do? Come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh, <laughs> 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 
Monkey, sir. Since he's been here, he's done well. He's very loyal, and so I'm promoting him right to the top. And so he says, in order to thank the general, he'd like to see you, sir. Nonsense! I'm the general. He's a common soldier. Yes, yes. Captain T. Sir, his kung fu isn't bad. Like to have him in my troop. What do you say? <laughs> well, no. <laughs> all right. <laughs> if you want him, then take him, by all means. Now, look. The general's just said that you're to be my new lieutenant. You like that? I'm very honored, sir. But I would like to thank the general. Could you help me to see him? Well, to see the general isn't so easy. And he has a lot on his mind now. Some Shaolin students help the rebels. We have proof. And we're going to have to do something about them quickly. And that job is given to you. Sir. If because of past friendships, you can't kill them, I would understand. I'm your man now, Captain. And I shall obey orders. It's good. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> don't believe it. I just don't believe it. That he would work for those chains. And what's more, he would actually kill our own man. Hey, well, he has. I saw him myself. I couldn't be wrong. He's doing well, too. He's an officer. Yeah, he has his own troops now, about 20 men. He just isn't the same man at all that you brought out of the woods so many years ago. He's quite different. Don't believe it. <sighs> well, I saw him coming out of the general's place with my very own eyes. I'll go see him. Ah, he's now one of the Ting's men. He won't care about old friendships. You go, and you'll die. If he really is a traitor, then I shall kill him. I greet both captains. Ho Yin. Mr. Iron is now your superior. My respects to you, sir, too. Captain, someone to see you. Who is it? 
Shaolin pupil, Fong Kong. Say no. Sir! Hold it. Isn't this Fong Kong one of the more senior students at Shaolin Temple? Yes. Well, this might save us a lot of trouble. Mr. Ryan, dispose of them. Rely on me. I'll deal with him. Good. I shall ask the general to reward you.
General's orders. You are to be rewarded for your loyalty with a young slave girl. May I thank the general in person? <laughs> well, if you want the honor of seeing the general himself, you'll have to kill some more Chinese first. Respect, sir. He denied it. I'm quite certain that it's him. I couldn't be mistaken. <laughs> you want to see the captain? You an old friend of his? Well, you can't see him. He's with the captains. <laughs> this time we'll work it out real careful. We'll get them all. Hmm? That's right. Wipe that lot out. <laughs> Mr. Ryan, this is a good chance for you. The general has decided to wipe out Shaolin, and you're to have command of this mission. To destroy those rebels once and for all. You go now, and prepare your men. Right. And also, the general will see you tomorrow. Go now. Ho oh, Yin, five years ago, you often posed as an anti-Ching man, joined up with some rebels, and then had them destroyed. <laughs> that was quite a good trick, but now I'm too well known for that one. Pity. Why? Thinking of trying it yourself? One of those times you did that, you exposed an anti-Ching organization. The leader's family were all wiped out, but one of them escaped. What are you driving at? Well, I was that man. I'd meant to wait longer until I could get at the general and perhaps the emperor. But now, they mean to destroy Shaolin. And so I can't wait. I don't know what you're saying. You don't? I mean to kill you. Get! Oh, 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 get!
so confidential that you have to talk here. Well, it's something only you should know. What is it? Hu Yin's dead. Huh? But how? Someone killed him. Who? A survivor of a whole family that was wiped out. Mm -hmm. I remember the case. But this survivor, where's he now? In front of you. And so you want to join your family?
Evening, sir. The captain's orders, but no visitors while he's at practice, sir. <laughs> It's you. Why do you come here so late? Everyone talks about the captain's fine kung fu, so I thought that I'd come here and see it for myself. Oh, you'd like to try me? Yes. Good. You can go. Sir, let's go. Thanks, Captain. Well, now, you choose your weapon. All right. Please. My job. I want to save Shaolin. Your Kung Fu! Show anyone mercy? Sergeant. You're right, the general wants all traitors. Take him away. Sir. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Why did you pretend to become our man? Only for one purpose. That was to kill you. Hey! <laughs> 